Be Brave 5K is this weekend, and it's at Floyd Lamb Park. Nevada Child Seekers has a strong passion to combat bullying. Their educational outreach coordinator, Heather Dodo, joins us in the studio to talk more about this. And it's exciting for this event. Yeah. Such a great location at Floyd <laughs> Lamb. I love that place. Yes, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> now, the 5K, this is an inaugural event, but you were saying that there's tons of programs that you've done like this before. This is yes. kind of just in addition to, mm -hmm. right? Absolutely. Um, so the Be Brave program is an anti-bully program. We go to schools. We're at over 40 schools, actually. Actually. And this is kind of like a way to bring awareness to the community, kind of get more people out. And the money that we raise from this is going to go, we're partnering with the Never Give Up Foundation for it to go to scholarships that where we ask students, you know, um, how they would end bullying. So um, all of the money is going to go to scholarships to end bullying. And we're, it's going to continue to f um, help our program at schools. Yeah, and we've got some pictures up here of some different kinds of events that you've had uh, last year and through the years and things like that. Bullying is... Um, it's always been a problem, but do you feel like it's a little bit uh, stronger now than it has been in the past? Are we getting better? How, how, do, how do we stand, do you think, when it comes to bullying? Well, the thing about bullying is most people look at it like, um, you know, it's something that's always going to happen. It's mm -hmm. something that you're, there's nothing you can do about. Well, the different approach that Be Brave has than other anti-bully programs is that we promote um, the bystanders to get up and essentially become heroes. Okay. Um, most of the time, students are afraid to uh, interfere in a bullying situation because they're afraid or or most of the time they pull out their phones it's just it encourages the bully where be brave we're telling them hey you could be saving this person's life um, you could be saving this person and and you could be making a difference and all it takes is for you to say, put your phone away and just say something right to mm -hmm. say something and report it and yes. act like you know I'm defending this person whether yes. I know them whether I don't and then you feel like a hero yeah absolutely it's a great approach okay tell me about Saturday's event a little bit if folks want to go what do they do and what can they expect to happen well uh, January 14th at Floyd Lamb Park um, you can register at be brave 5k.com. Uh, you can also register the day of the event and it's only $25 and it includes a Be Brave t-shirt. Um, there's going to be performers there, music, we're going to have a DJ and it's in a nice location. There's lakes everywhere, ducks, um, peacocks. It's a, it's a really beautiful place and um, it's going to be a lot of fun and we'll talk about all the things that we offer uh, when we go out to schools as well. All right. And obviously, um, you're going to probably continue to do these kinds of programs and oh, probably yes. continue this on next year yeah, as well, Hopefully, right? we can make this an annual thing. Yeah, Absolutely. bullying is definitely an issue. And with online, I think especially with all the online social media and things like that, it's become uh, something that needs to be addressed. So uh, congratulations on getting this started and, and obviously um, making a difference in the community. Well, thank you. All <laughs> right. Well, Floyd Lamb Park again on Saturday, 7 to 11 a.m. Be Brave 5K. If you want to head out there or sign up in advance, feel free. We'll be back after this.